Colorado State finished last season by winning two of its final three games, which went a long way in helping Jim McElwain's efforts to change the culture on campus. How we finished and how we closed I think was very important. But then that carried over when the guys got back after break and, and went right into our RAMU program. You could see we're a lot farther ahead during spring practices. And, and I think, you know, the commitment that they've given over the summer is something that, uh, you know, really wasn't there before. We've started to really take hold of what he's all about, um, you know, what, what he expects from us. Um, you, you can see it, a complete difference in the attitude of my teammates and myself. The Rams are working hard to find a starting quarterback during camp. The competition is likely between two guys, junior Garrett Grayson and sophomore Connor Smith. Both played in six games last season. Garrett Grayson, he's, he's a very athletic kid. Um, yeah, I think he can play wide receiver, you know, anything he wants to play because he's just so athletic. Um, he's a good leader. He knows exactly what uh, is supposed to be going on in the offense. So uh, that makes it easy for, you know, guys like me, the offensive line, to really kind of mesh with him. He's going to go to the air on first down. Connor did some really good things. He can make throws that, you know, guys around this country can't. The Rams will likely split carries between two running backs. Chris Woke and Donnell Alexander both have the potential to be 1,000-yard backs behind an offensive line that consists of four seniors and one junior. They're really, really selfless guys. They, they really want the best for the team. So, um, you know, they, they'd be happy to let the other guy go in and take some rest. Or if one guy's doing better in a game, let him get more reps. And if some guy gets hurt, they're willing to step up. So it's, it's really cool to see those guys interact with each other. You're able to stay fresh and then you know that guy with the hot hand coming down the stretch? Good, hard running up to now he's ready to really take it. And, and that's kind of the, the, the script I guess I'd like to follow. The Rams' defense will be anchored by a seasoned group of defensive backs and linebackers, headlined by Shaq Barrett, who's been one of the top defensive playmakers in his two seasons in the Mountain West. We just need to come, just come out there and go hard, just have pride out there. If you have pride, I mean, just don't let your person block you back five yards. Just come out there, hold your gap, get rid of your person trying to meet the tackle. And that is like pride to help you out a lot because you don't want to be out there and getting all pancaked and looking embarrassed out there because I had, I had pride on. I don't want nobody to come out there and throw me to the ground and have people looking at me because I think I'm a better player than that. And I uh, actually think that our whole team is better players than that and that should never happen. The Rams open up the season in Denver against their in-state rival, Colorado. For the Mountain West Network, I'm Jesse Kurtz.